Good times at home as well, and that's why we have Mark Saltzman here today. Smart Home Solutions, they can help you save time and money and add modern conveniences. For a look at what's new, uh, from water sensors that can detect a leak to voice-activated window coverings, we're joined by tech expert and host of Tech Talk on News Talk 1010, Mark Saltzman. We, we like to do this, coming, <laughs> coming through the window you in your home. Nice hello, hello, you. hello. Nice to see you. <laughs> I, I'm always fascinated by what you bring in, because I always Thanks. wonder how I can incorporate them in my house. Cool. Um, and I've done the first one. Rise Smart Shades. Yeah, uh, really Toronto cool. company. Yeah, Rise, R Y S E. Smart Shade, as the name suggests, turns any window coverings you have, any blinds, into motorized ones, so long as it has a beaded chain, whether it's plastic or metal. Very easy to install. You just mount it to the side of the window. Uh, frame, if you will, and then you can use a button on yep. the device to, ri to raise and lower the blinds. You can use an app. You can use your voice with a smart speaker, uh, Amazon, Alexa, uh, uh, Google, or Apple. And uh, you can even set schedules. So certain times of the day, you can have your blinds uh, rise and lower. It's just so convenient. Great for seniors, too, who may have some you know dexterity uh, challenges. And it's uh, $1.99 to start at Best Buy. I like the button. It's like the unsnooze button. You hit it, <laughs> and then the right. light comes yeah. in and wakes you up. Yeah, awesome. Okay, this is important. Uh, Mo and Water Security yeah. Solutions. Yeah, this is a family of products from Moen to protect your home from water damage. What we're seeing here is uh, the Moen Flow Smart Water uh, Monitor and Shut Off. It's mm. basically a valve that you connect to your home's water supply. If it detects a frozen pipe, a leaky oh, pipe, wow. uh, someone left the faucet running, uh, it will not only turn off the water to your home, but it'll send you a push notification to your phone to warn wow. you so you can minimize any damage done. There's also inexpensive uh, little leak detectors that we just saw there. Yep. You can place around your home, even a sub pump monitor that will monitor your water levels in real time, and then again push a notification to your phone. That's it right there, just in case there's an issue, so it'll save you money and, and a real headache, obviously, in the long run. So that's from Moen. The prices vary, but Moen.ca has more. So important. I mean, there were a lot of water yeah. issues this oh summer with the flooding, and such you a wet want to minimize that. Yeah. Okay, speaking of money saving at home, uh, tell us about an app that monitors electricity yeah. usage. So going from water to electricity, yep. I swear a blue streak when I open up my uh, <laughs> my utility bill every month. Yeah, I'm sure too. not alone in Ontario. So speaking of control and protection, the Schneider Home app from Schneider Electric can automate your smart home devices or let you control them to monitor and control the energy usage in your home to lower your monthly utility bill. So what we're seeing here is a Wiser branded uh, device from Schneider Electric that you connect to your control panel uh, oh. and, and then from there you can monitor again in real time, yep. see what appliances are using what or for $44 to start Schneider X series wiring devices you can place around your home, connect your lights uh, and your blinds and all that, and see in real time. With Now with Matter support, Matter is a platform mm -hmm. that makes it easy to control. So se.com for Schneider Electric is great to save money Pays on your for electric itself bill. in the long run, That's right? exactly it, yeah. Okay, I love app-controlled appliances. Yeah. Tell me about well, this. Well, I'm a big Breville. fan of food prep, because like yeah. I have three kids who are in their early 20s, <laughs> and we all know those food services are very convenient, but very expensive. So I like this. Uh, so this is from Breville. It's the Paradise 9. Breville has a family of kitchen top or countertop smart devices. I love that this works with an app called uh, Breville so Plus. Cool. But the idea is that it's a food processor with a wide feed chute, does not take up a lot of space. So even for small kitchens in, in tiny condos in Toronto, this is great. Uh, and it's color coded with the recipes on the app. So there's oh. a smart element. It's optional, but the Breville Plus app is great. It's all color coded with the accessories, uh, you know, different kinds of dicing <clears throat> attachments and blades that it's all color coded. It's 519 at Breville.ca. I love it. And if you ordered that online, you want it delivered and you don't want those porch pirates yeah. grabbing it from you. Nice segue. Yeah, <laughs> yes. Amazon just last week announced Amazon Key in Garage Delivery. This is a service that if you're a Prime member, then you can choose a key at checkout, Amazon Key, and it'll give a vetted driver the ability to leave a package in your garage. Mm. And they, uh, no more than five feet in your garage, and they close the door uh, when they leave, the garage door, and you're notified on an app. Uh, they cannot go back in. If you don't have a smart garage from the likes of Chamberlain, the MyQ brand, branded uh, smart garages uh, openers that are out there for $30 is what I brought here. It turns any uh, electric uh, garage door opener into a smart one, Love app controlled, that. so it's called Chamberlain Smart Garage Control for 30 bucks. So again, it's giving you peace of mind to yeah. stop porch pirates and protect your packages from inclement weather as well. So it's Nick, been in the States since 2017. It's finally in Canada and coast to coast, and, uh, which is awesome. And then we finally, we've got the RBC yeah. security, which is free. Yeah, it Who is free. Like free? And, yes, and another <laughs> way to save money. October is Cybersecurity Awareness Month. And so RBC has this Be Cyber Aware website, rbc.com slash cyber, with tips to better protect yourself in the digital age. There was this cybersecurity 
Cybersecurity Index that found that Canadians, while aware of cyber threats out there, Bill, 77% mm -hmm. of those admitted they are they're engaging in activity that is putting their information at risk, like reusing passwords, uh, like uh, using free Wi-Fi hotspots, which is a no-no from a cybersecurity standpoint. <laughs> so it's a great website, rbc.com slash cyber. Thank you so much for bringing in your tech tips Thanks. and tech Pleasure. talk Sundays yeah. on News Talk 1010. 5 o'clock. Thank All you right. so much.